About 20,000 years ago, Earth was locked in an ice age so severe that vast ice sheets, some 3 kilometers thick, blanketed nearly 30% of the planet's land. Global temperatures plunged 6 degrees Celsius below today's average, and sea levels dropped 120 meters, exposing vast coastal plains. This frozen epoch transformed landscapes, reshaped ecosystems, and tested human survival, creating legacies that still influence our world. Gigantic glaciers dominated the northern hemisphere like icy titans reshaping continents. The Laurentide ice sheet smothered Canada and the northern United States, gouging out the Great Lakes and carving valleys from the Arctic to present-day New York. Across the Atlantic, the Fennoscandian ice sheet draped Scandinavia and Britain in ice, while mountain glaciers swelled in the Alps, Andes, and Himalayas. These glaciers scoured bedrock, carved fjords, and deposited fertile soils, including the lowest deposit that would become today's U.S. Corn Belt and Northern European farmlands. Tundra and permafrost stretched south to France and the U.S. Midwest, creating harsh, treeless mammoth steppes. With water locked in ice, exposed continental shelves created land bridges that transformed human history. The Bering Land Bridge allowed early humans to migrate into the Americas, evidenced by archaeological sites like Monte Verde in Chile. The Sunda Shelf connected Southeast Asian islands, while Dogoland linked Britain to continental Europe, supporting thriving hunter-gatherer communities before rising seas claimed it. These migration routes established genetic diversity patterns, still visible in human populations worldwide. The climate grew profoundly cold and arid, expanding deserts while shrinking tropical rainforests. Step tundra landscapes supported remarkable megafauna like woolly mammoths, cave bears, and saber-toothed cats, all adapted to frigid conditions. Hunter-gatherer societies demonstrated extraordinary adaptability, developing sophisticated clothing, constructing complex shelters, and creating extraordinary cave art at Lascaux and Chauvet. This artistic explosion during peak glacial conditions suggests harsh environments drove humans to develop complex symbolic communication crucial for survival. Around 19,000 years ago, Earth began warming due to Milankovitch cycles. These periodic changes in Earth's orbit shifted the distribution of solar radiation across the planet. As temperatures rose, warming oceans released dissolved CO2, creating feedback loops that accelerated the thaw. Meltwater pulses raised sea levels rapidly, flooding coastal plains and the land bridges that had enabled human migration. This transition proved catastrophic for megafauna, which faced deadly combinations of rapid climate change and intensifying human hunting pressure. Archaeological evidence suggests human arrival in new territories often coincided with extinctions, eliminating woolly mammoths, giant ground sloths, and other iconic species that had thrived for millennia. The last glacial maximums influence persists today. Fertile soils across the U.S. Corn Belt and Northern Europe trace directly to glacial deposits, while major cities occupy valleys carved by ice sheets. 
the Great Lakes, Scandinavian fjords, and countless geographical features remain monuments to this frozen epoch. Studying this ancient ice age uncovers Earth's climate sensitivity and ice sheet behavior. This knowledge is vital as we track accelerating ice loss in Greenland and Antarctica today. The last glacial maximum demonstrates our planet's capacity for dramatic transformation and our species' remarkable adaptability. As we confront rapid climate change, this frozen world offers both sobering lessons about Earth's climate system and inspiring evidence of human resilience when facing planetary scale challenges. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.